Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Jamie and this is Texas Girl DIYs and today I have got a haul for you. It is not a uh, Dollar General haul, it is not a Dollar Tree haul, it is a trash to treasure haul. I had recently visited some yard sales today and I am really really excited to show you some of the things that I had picked up. I also had gotten a couple of things from when my husband and I went antiquing and I wanted to show you those things really quick too. So I'm actually going to go ahead and start with that because there's only a couple things there, um, including this armoire that I'm sitting in front of right here. Um, I'm going to link the video that um, where I repurpose this armoire. So if you missed that video, I'm going to link it down below for you. So the first thing I had picked up was this antique coffee bean grinder. This was such an awesome find. This is wood on the bottom and it's got a drawer that pulls out. The top part I believe is a uh, cast iron. Um, it's got the lid where you would open, you put your coffee beans in there and then close that back up and then, it, and then you would turn it. This is like one of those really awesome finds where I just, I could not leave the store without it. I had gotten it for $10 thought it was a great deal and I have a shelf that is above my cabinets in my kitchen I've decided that I'd like to um, continue picking up um, antique pieces like this and just decorating my shelf with that I thought you know very farmhouse and very cool the next thing I had picked up at the antique store was this sleigh um, this is a this is wood here and this is like a metal on the on the bottom here I'm not sure what do you call this part of the sleigh the not blades I don't know what you, I don't know what you call it but anyway because of Christmas um, I'm probably not gonna do anything with this I'm probably not even gonna paint this I just wanted to decorate with it um, for display purposes probably by my uh, fireplace you know just something cutesy Christmassy with this sleigh oh and by the way I had also picked this up for two dollars at the antique store so moving on to the fun garage sale stuff, um, I am super excited. I had I had picked up this ladder. It's just a little mini ladder. It's got a sawtooth um, hanger that is on the back of it. I thought this would be a really cool uh, thing to just kind of display for Christmas. I mean, or for any um, for any day actually. But one of the things I wanted to do with this is to display it somewhere in my house and then just do a cutesy little. Um, Christmas wreath um, hanging off of the ladder. So I got this for just a dollar. The next fun thing that I had found was this barn. It's actually a picture frame. I had picked this up for 75 cents. It's not wood, it's, it's actually plastic, but um, I decided that uh, it's really cute as it is, but I'm thinking about going with the black and white theme, um, the black and white, you know, farmhouse theme. So probably putting a photo of something in there there probably used to be glass in this there's no glass here it's just completely open so i'm not really sure what i'll put in there but anyway i just thought this was a great find the next thing i could not pass up was um one of the yard sales had a very big display of um uh christmas ribbons so i got three of these um i got three of these for just a dollar because they were I think these these two here were just 50 cents a piece and because they had kind of already used a little bit of it they just gave it to me for free so I probably should have checked the rest of the rack to see what else uh, because the lady said that um, anything any of the ribbon that had been used that had already been opened up and everything um, to just take it and I probably should have looked through all of them to see what else I could find that was already open, but I just grabbed these three. The next thing I had grabbed was this super cute Campbell Soup mug. This is glass, and I don't know if you can see this. This is so cute. It has the classic Campbell Soup kids, and what do they got? The, um, the tomato vine, can you see this? They're next to the tomato vine on this side and then on this side here they got the little girl in the wheelbarrow how adorable is this i think i had i did pick this up for five dollars i don't know if you can see that i did get this for five dollars there was a second one um had a different picture on it i really should have grabbed the other one but um i think maybe if they were selling it maybe two or three dollars cheaper <laughs> maybe I would have grabbed both of them but you know what my daughter she loves 
Uh, we have a Campbell's Soup cup, but it's plastic. It's it's cute. It's smaller than this, but this is glass. This is like, th this is definitely a keepsake for sure. I just think this was super cute. The next thing I had picked up was this here. This is metal, and I just thought this was really cute. This is perfect for Christmas because we've already got like a, um, I think it was like a poinsettia on here and then like the holly berries here and as you can see i had gotten this for a dollar and you can hang it um i thought this would be really cute you can just display some um christmas flowers or some christmas floral in here and then just like hanging on a wall my husband had a great idea of uh, repurposing this and having like a letters to santa kind of thing you can put the letters inside of it and hang it down a little lower so our eight-year-old can reach it too and send a letter to santa the next thing i got this was actually pretty big i got this here and as you can see it's got one two three four shelves I know it's kind of big and it's kind of hard to get it all in the camera, but I did get it for just a dollar. This thing is disgusting. It, <laughs> it has got, uh, can you see the cobwebs? Can you see the cobwebs on here? That's yeah, that's gorgeous. And that I like, you like my nice cobwebs and it is dusty It's disgusting. <laughs> it needs to be cleaned, but I can do that. I can clean this up sand it in some places because it needs some sanding and a fresh coat of paint and i thought this would be really great for displaying christmas or any kind of diys that i i do and then i just actually have a place to put them and the last thing i got was this awesome trunk this was probably one of my favorite finds for the day um it it, it was ten dollars and it opens up here and it's it's pretty deep inside it looks so awesome i love this trunk i'm not really sure what i'm going to use it for um i think my husband actually has an idea of what he can use it for and that is totally fine with me i just love it i just think this was a really awesome find i love old you know antique things like this um i'm not going to paint it i'm not going to do anything to it i just i really love this and yeah. Okay. So that is it for today's haul. That is pretty much all I got. I kind of wish that uh, I'd like to get out there and go check out some more yard sales, but that is it for today. And I hope that you like this video. Stick around so you can see some of the DIYs, some of the stuff I am going to, you know, DIY and do something fun with. Other things, I am just going to leave them as is because I think they are gorgeous the way they are. So anyway, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. All right, y'all have a wonderful, blessed day. Bye.